watching WCVB TV Channel 5 in high definition. This is News Center 5 at 5. Local live coverage you can count on. And from advice to books to cars, anything that Oprah touches, it turns to gold. Yeah, call her Midas. So imagine how happy a Cape Bakery is now that Oprah is buying their delicious pies. That story is next. Just about anyone who's ever had any kind of endorsement from Oprah has gone on to reap enormous benefits. And if that's true, then the talk show diva's love for pie is going to pay big dividends for a company on the Cape. With a story, New Center 5's Amalia Beretta. These days, the Centerville Pie Company is 10 employees in perpetual motion. Co-owner Laurie Bowen heads an assembly line of two, furiously making chicken pot pies, with pie's popularity suddenly skyrocketing because of co-owner Kristen Broadley's brilliant idea to send some to Oprah Winfrey when she was on the Cape last week to attend Eunice Kennedy Shriver's funeral. I told her she was nuts. I said, you, you know, chances are the bodyguards are going to eat them. She called me. And when I stopped screaming, I talked to her. <laughs> Word has gotten out that Oprah loved the Centerville Pie Company's chicken pot pie. You know, everybody always says, you know, Oprah has that Midas touch. Unbelievable. I've had calls. Um, the mayor of Amarillo, Texas called the other day. I've had calls as far as all the coastline of California. You know, South Carolina, Texas, Chicago, Tennessee. It's just it's phenomenal. Yes, business is up 50%. There is now a wait of several days for a chicken pot pie and their dessert pies, too. Wow, what is Laurie and Kristen have also developed some tremendous coattails as a result of Oprah's blessing. Centerville Pie is now getting lots of calls from companies that want to set them up with shipping and distributing their fabulous products. There's a pound of chicken in each pie, and the crust is a secret recipe. You know, the girls have a saying that all our pies are like snowflakes. No two are the same. Expansion plans are in the works with thoughts about hiring disabled adults to beef up the staff. In Centerville, Amalia Barrada, New Center 5.